This is a massive six pointer in the survival of the Premier League. <laughs> So guys, today back for another video on the channel. Today we're going to be doing another match preview, and today it's for the game against Huddersfield at three o'clock at St James's Park. I will be doing the vlog like always. Vlog will be out around about half past five. So if you want to go and check the vlog out, leave a like on the video and just watch it when it's out. Turn notifications on. But as you may know, uploads have not been cons consistent, and I can't do anything about it. School revision, college stuff. I'm. Hopefully, go to college or get an apprenticeship and some sort, some sort of like that. But I want to be making videos for you guys, but I unfortunately can't. But, anyways, massive game on Saturday. I'll be there, as I said. But Huddersfield are not looking that good, and we're on decent form. So, we should go with this game very confident and hope for the win. And I will start by talking about my club, Newcastle. Like, I'm pre-recording this because I've got a bit of time, but I'm recording this on the Monday, and this video, was, well, you'll see it on Thursday, but I've seen some of that probably Matt Ritchie's injured, which is crucial because in the last four games, which would beat Man U, Drew to Bournemouth, lost to Liverpool and beats um, Southampton, he's been involved in m most of them goals. He scored against Manchester United, he got an assist against Bournemouth, and he scored a goal against Southampton, so you can't ask for much more. And if he is injured, that's unfortunately, we can't do anything about that. But when you look at, like, players like Shlomani, apparently he could be back in. Like, I'm recording some Monday, so there's still three days and there could be some injuries or, like, some big news coming out from Newcastle, but... It's so tough, it's so tight as well, around the bottom. I'm going gonna, gonna to scroll down now, right? We are sitting 13th. But when you look at the teams who could get relegated, I would say from Bournemouth downwards. Bournemouth from 36, right? And then the relegation spot, who's Southampton in, who's got, it was 18th, who's got 28 points. So when you look at that, that is only uh, 8 points. So if, South, how, so if Southampton win the next two games, and Bournemouth lose their next two games, Southampton can bounce straight back up. And if we can get back to back wins at St James's Park, that could change our season. It's not, we're not mathematically safe if we win this game, but honest God, I think we will be done. We'll, we'll stay up. And Newcastle, it's, I don't know if it's, it's good times in Newcastle. A massive break. We had a game against Royal uh, uh, Antwerp. Uh, uh, drew 1 1 and Richie scored, which I've still got a real corner with Richie when he did score. I'm counting that as a goal because he scored. But, anyways. Let's, let's talk about Huddersfield and let's see how their form's looking and some of their key players. So when you look at Huddersfield's record, they've beat West Brom 2-1. They got beat at Tottenham 2-0, which it was a fair result. Tottenham were mostly going to win that game. 0-0 to Swansea. We drew to Swansea as well, but... And then finally, they got beat to Crystal Palace last time like, they played a game, which is crucial. Because Palace winning, that kind of stuff... But some of their key players, I think their goalkeeper, Sol Loyal, so, so, I don't I don't know his name, he's um, from Denmark. He's, I think he's quite good. And you've got to think, the last time we played them, it was 1-0 Huddersfield with Aaron Moy. He's back in the squad now, but some of their like, players are good. Like, they've got Mooney up front, they've got... Who else have got? I'm trying to think of players off the top of my head. Obviously, Aaron Moy, I did mention him. Tom Ince, I think he's developing in the Premier League a lot more than... Sorry, he's like a Jacob Murphy type of player. But I'm going to say this now. Every, like, for the last like three home games, I've said that we're not going to win. And we have. Man U, I said, no, nah, we're not going to win. We won. Southampton, I was not confident. We won. For this game, I'm going to go for a 1-1 draw. And if we win this game, for the rest of the season, I'll go for a 1-1 draw in every game because... <laughs> we're gonna be we're winning games like that. If you did enjoy the video, subscribe on I don't want to say it, just subscribe, watch my most recent video and yes, if you anyone wants to come and meet me in, in the stadium to be in the vlog, that's perfectly fine. I'll be in the stadium at 2.15 and follow my social medias, link in the description, and yeah, thanks for watching and goodbye.